In order to gain the full benefits of this sequence, move gently with awareness and listen to your body. If you feel discomfort or pain, back off a little and take a few moments to pause, breathe and rest. Come back to the practice whenever you feel comfortable. Take a moment to set an intention for your practice today. Choose a word or quality that you would like to invite into your life. A word that can help give meaning to your practice today. Some examples might be breath, acceptance, joy, peace, compassion, endurance, or strength. Pick the quality that resonates with you most deeply. The chair practice begins with neck and shoulder movements. In the first three movements, your head and neck will move continuously with your breath as the rest of your body stays relaxed and still. Keep these movements very gentle, take care and avoid pushing. Sit back comfortably against the chair so that your back and spine feel supported. Begin with your head centered and your neck in a neutral position so that your chin is parallel to the floor. Relax and soften the muscles in your face. Soften your jaw and the inside of your mouth. Relax your tongue. On your next exhale, slowly release your chin down toward your chest and feel a mild stretch in the back of your neck. And on your inhale, lift your chin towards the ceiling and feel a gentle stretch in the throat area. Exhale and release your chin down toward your chest again. And then inhale and lift your chin towards the ceiling. Continue this movement on your own, moving gently with your breath. Now bring your head back to center. On your next exhale, slowly turn your head to the right. Then inhale your head back to center. Exhale and slowly turn your head to the left. And again, inhale your head back to center. Continue these smooth, gentle movements on your own, moving with your own breath. Then bring your head back to center. Now slowly exhale and tilt your head to the right so that the left side of the neck feels a gentle lengthening. Then inhale and move your head back to center. Then exhale and tilt your head to the left. And again, bring the head to center as you breathe in. Continue these smooth, gentle movements on your own. Move gently with your breath. Now bring your head back to center and pause. Now release your arms down to the side and shake them out. As you inhale, squeeze and lift your shoulders up towards your ears. And as you exhale, drop your shoulders down. Again, inhale and lift your shoulders up to your ears and exhale, release your shoulders down. Continue these smooth, gentle movements on your own. Try exhaling with the mouth slightly open and release the out breath slowly. Now bring your shoulders back to a neutral, relaxed position. 
Now as you inhale, bring your shoulders forward and then up. And then as you exhale, roll your shoulders back and release them down. Inhale, bring your shoulders forward and then up. And then as you exhale, roll your shoulders back and release them down. Continue these gentle movements on your own. Move gently with your breath. Now bring your shoulders back to a neutral, relaxed position again. At the end of this practice, shake out the arms and hands and do some free form movements. Notice how your shoulders and neck feel. You may feel greater ease and freedom. This opening sequence can help relieve tension, tightness and stress that is commonly held in the neck, shoulder and upper back area. Now extend your arms out from your shoulders with your palms facing down. As you inhale, point your fingers up and as you exhale, point your fingers down. Inhale and point your fingers up and exhale, point the fingers down. Continue these smooth, easeful movements on your own. Then, make gentle fists with your hands. And slowly rotate your wrists. Keep your breath flowing as you move. Now pause and switch direction. Keeping your hands in fists, inhale and open your hands wide to stretch your fingers. Then exhale and slowly close your hands. Inhale, open your hands wide and exhale, close the hands into fists. Continue these smooth movements on your own. Move gently with your breath. These hand movements can help increase blood circulation in the wrists and hands. They can also provide a way to counteract the neuropathy that can be common to some cancer treatments. Now pause, rest your palms back down onto your thighs. These next movements help to stretch and open the muscles in the trunk. Again, listen to your body and respect its limitations. Extend the arms out in front of you with your palms facing upwards. Then bend your elbows to a 90 degree angle. Your hands will be facing towards you. Keep your hands directly over your elbows. As you inhale, Open your arms as far out to each side as they will go, and then exhale and bring the elbows towards each other. Continue these smooth movements on your own. Let your breath guide you. Now rest, place your hands back down onto your legs. Interlace your fingers and place your hands over your heart center. Drop your gaze slightly down. As you inhale, turn your palms away from you 
and press them forward so that the arms extend. Gaze forwards at your hands. Feel the upper back area spread. As you exhale, turn your palms back inwards and draw them to your heart center. Inhale and again press your palms and arms forward, looking forward, and then exhale and bring your hands back in towards your heart, looking down. Continue these gentle movements on your own a few more times. Again, let the breath guide you. After practicing these movements repetitively, hold the extended position for a few extra breaths if this feels comfortable. And allow your upper back to stretch gently as you breathe into this area of your body. Now pause and rest. Notice how you feel. Sit forward in your chair for the next movements, which are called cat rolls. Sit up tall and adjust the feet so that your ankles are directly under your knees. Now inhale slowly and lift and open your chest towards the sky. Draw the shoulders back and slide the hands back towards the hips. As you exhale, slowly slide your hands forward. Draw your shoulders forward. Again, inhale and lift your chest towards the sky. Feel your back arching. And then exhale and round your back. Continue these smooth, gentle, spine-freeing movements on your own, moving gently with your breath. As you continue to move between these two stretches, pay close attention to how you're moving Make your movements and the breath flow smoothly and fluidly. These cat rolls can help increase overall spinal flexibility and increase circulation. Now come back to neutral and notice how you feel. Notice how the back of your body feels. Now notice how the front of your body feels. Did these movements energize you, relax you? Now open your feet wider than your hips and rest your hands on your legs. Take a deep inhale and feel the front of your body lengthen. And then as you exhale, hinge from the hip creases and lean forward. Rest your elbows onto your knees so that you feel supported. Your back stays at a 45 degree angle. Relax your upper back area and direct your gaze forward along the ground so that your neck stays long. Keep your chest lifted and open and breathe slowly and steadily into this posture. Notice how it feels. This pose is helpful for stretching out and releasing tension from the lower back area. When you're ready, Place your hands, palms down onto your knees and press back up carefully. Come back into seated mountain.
and take a few resting breaths. Now do some hip walking in the chair. Hip walking in the chair can provide similar benefits to walking. This action can help bring us back into balance. Then come back to seated mountain. Sit forward in the chair. And release your arms down to the side. Relax your shoulders. Check back in with your face, neck and jaw and soften again. This next movement is called sun salutation in the chair. This energizing sequence connects your movements to the flow of the breath, refreshing your body and your mind, drawing your knee in towards your chest in a seated lunge position can also help with digestion. To begin, inhale and raise your arms forward and up. Bring the arms back as far as is comfortable. You can lift your gaze up if that feels good. As you exhale, lower your arms back down. Pause as you inhale, then exhale and hug your right knee into your chest. Inhale and release your right foot back to the floor. Now exhale and hug your left knee into your chest. Inhale and release your left foot back down to the floor. Pause as you exhale, and then begin the sequence again. Continue these smooth, gentle, spine-freeing movements on your own, moving gently with your breath. Invite your movements here to be smooth and rhythmic and let your breath be your guide. Pause here, hugging your knee in, and begin to gently and slowly rotate your ankle. Keep your breath flowing as you move. Now pause and rotate your ankle in the opposite direction. Then relax your foot. Now inhale and point your toes down toward the floor and exhale and lift your toes up. Continue on your own. Inhale and point the toes down and exhale and lift the toes up. Now, interlace your hands around the back of your thigh to support your leg. Inhale and extend your leg out, straightening it as much as you can, and then exhale and bend your knee back towards you. Continue these movements on your own. Move with your breath. Now rest the right foot back down to the floor. Now pause and hug your left knee into your chest. Begin to gently and slowly rotate your left ankle joint. Keep your breath flowing as you move. Now pause and rotate your ankle in the opposite direction. Now inhale and point your toes down toward the floor and exhale and lift your toes up. Continue on your own. Inhale and point the toes down 
and exhale and lift the toes up. Now interlace your hands around the back of your left thigh. Inhale and extend your leg out. And then exhale and bend the knee back towards you. Continue on your own. These leg movements can improve flexibility and circulation in the feet, knees, and hips. Come into seated mountain pose again. Rest your hands back on your legs. Notice how you feel at the end of the chair salutes. Do you feel more energized? Also notice how your breath is flowing. The next movement is a gentle spinal twist. Sit forward in your chair with a long spine. Place your right hand on the outside of your left leg and place your left hand on the side of the chair. Look forward and on your next inhalation, lengthen the spine upwards. As you exhale, gently twist to the left. Come back to center as you inhale and again move into the twist on your exhale. Tune into the movement and the breath flowing together and keep these movements very gentle and easeful. Now, if it feels good, stay for several breaths in the twist. Avoid pushing beyond your place of comfort. Now carefully come back to center and pause. Now place your left hand on the outside of your right leg and place your right hand on the side of the chair. Look forward and as you inhale, lengthen your spine upwards. As you exhale, gently twist to the right. Come back to center as you inhale, and again move into the twist as you exhale. Continue to move in and out of the twist on your own. Now, if it feels good, stay for several breaths in the twist. These twisting movements can activate the nerves and muscles along the spine and can also help to open the breathing muscles connected to the lungs. Now come back to center. Sit back in the chair and take a few resting breaths. As you settle in seated mountain pose, Come back to the intention that you set at the start of your practice. Release your arms alongside you and open your palms forward, feeling a gentle opening in your shoulders. Now inhale and circle your arms out and up. Imagine that you're gathering that quality up and then exhale and bring your palms together and lower your hands down through center and imagine that you're bringing that quality inside you. Practice several rounds on your own, gathering the quality up and bringing it down into the center of your being. Let this be a moving meditation. Concentrate on merging the breath with the movements and being present in every moment. Now pause with the hands resting at the heart. Move your hands away from you and start to rub your palms together to generate some heat in your hands.
Now place your hands gently over your closed eyes without putting any direct pressure on your eyes. Your nostrils should be clear so that you can breathe freely. Tilt your head very slightly forward and start to tune into your breath. Direct the breath into your hands, into your face, and into your eyes, and relax all the muscles in your face, including your eye muscles. Now slowly wipe your face with your hands. Wipe any tension, stress, and fatigue away from your face. Now rest your hands back onto your legs. Sit quietly and allow your body to settle. Take some time to integrate all the movements of the practice and allow the many benefits to soak in.